What is up, everybody? It's the Game Dex here. We are back again with some more Pokemon Infinity. I know this episode is late. It's even late at the time that I'm recording, but we're getting it done. I, like I said, Monday through Fridays, daily Pokemon Infinity. I don't exactly... I still don't know what we're going to do during the weekends. It's still undecided completely, but we'll get there. We'll get back to complete daily episodes. But for now, it's Monday through Friday, and it is late, but we're back in it. Pokemon Infinity... I don't... It's been a few days for me. Ah, oh, I could have had a Trap Inch here. I don't remember what I got here, but I don't think it was anything nearly that good. And why did I switch Goose from the front? Goose is going to be killing it here, like... I know there's possibly Cacneas, which would be rough for Goose. But, like, everything else, perfectly easy. I mean... Okay, there's, there's Skorupis, too. Maybe not the easiest for Goose, but still... That's not... Goose isn't weak to the either. Okay, we can keep going around. And around. And around. Um, I do hope we can get through Doomstone Desert in today's episode. Um, I'm pretty sure once we finally get to where we're going... We're going to have some story elements back, which I'm looking forward to. Because this has just been Exploration Route. Ginormous City... And everything I've just I've been missing. I've been missing actually going. Uh, we'll just hit you with a nice old return. I don't want to waste the good luck I'm gonna get with Aqua Tail on a Skorupi, so return's fine. Max happiness, good enough damage for me. Skorupi gone. Here comes the Geodude. Or the Gabite. Interesting. Knocked out anyways. Does not matter. What's next? Ooh, Charlie's gaining experience. Our team. Hippopotas. You know, it would have been brighter if you went Hippopotas and then Gabite, but... I'm, I'm not going to be the one that tells you that bit of information because you've lost. Ooh, Warden. Ooh, Warden. I'm going to trust Dragon Pulse more. I need to relook at the stats to see. Do I want to focus on physical or special moves for our boy? Ooh, hit pout on. Level 50. Completely going to be rocking the rock slide. So when we don't knock it out here, it's going to hit me with a crunch. I'll take it because... Done. Fight. Over. Next. Send me free to the next trainer. Darren. Okay, so let's see. Warden. Wardern, I mean. Physical. Ah, okay. You know, it's fine. It's still going to be a strong move. But Dragon Claw, once it becomes an option, is what I want. Okay, that's fine. Hyper Potion. I forgot to buy potions. I don't remember how much I have, but... Oh, oh. <laughs> oh. Our enemies are done for. Once I start actually planning items before battle and not just going straight into the fight, our enemies are done for. There's nothing stopping us now. Except for Pokemon. That's what I got. That's what, this is what I knocked out. I could have had a Flygon, and I get stuck with a Fainted, not even on my team, Pokemon. No. No. There's no way. Okay, well, here's another encounter. Possibly another encounter. And our encounter is... Dupes Claws. Well, Species Claws, because we had a Geodude earlier in the Let's Play. Thank goodness. 
for that. Like, I don't remember much about him, but I remember we had one. We have a Zubat currently in our PC. Okay, okay. Not looking good for us. Still Species Claws. What, what am I supposed to do? Like, am I supposed to explore this cave, or am I supposed to be dealing, say, Geodude? And I have it caught, so... Proof right there, we didn't mess up on the Graveler. Come on, give me something good. Dusk Ball. Okay, I can't go down the ladder. Another dupes. Huh. Huh, are we gonna just not be able to get anything right now? I'm gonna give it a few more encounters. Okay, well, we're not getting an encounter here. Got it. Understood. Didn't want you anyways. Yeah, I still do have some hype potions, which is good. We can make it work. We can keep going. Keep traveling. <laughs> have I battled you? Did I battle you? I did not. You're going to have a bronze ore. You're going to lead with a bronze ore, that's for sure. Explorer Indiana. Call him Jones. Because it's actually Indiana Jones. I don't know if this Gengar in this game has Levitate or not. But Aqua Tail does the trick. It does not matter. We don't care about levitating Gengars because they're done. Sam. Bro. Can we chill? Thank you. Okay, we're good. We're good. Calm down, Ryan. Calm down. And then Sand Slash. Okay. We're good. No need to worry. Gengar, Alakazam combo, a little scary. Sand Slash, not so much. But the two of them together. He got sand in his eyes. Okay. We're gonna we're gonna give Hunter Jr. some action. Which could be a bad decision, but it's fine. Hip of a toss. We could have had a hip of a toss. The only issue with hip of a toss and Nuzlocks is the sandstream ability. But if we rock it out with a, another type like that, we would have been awesome. Could have had a sand isle. Oh, I love Crocodile is, like, one of my favorite Pokemons from Gen 5. Like, no lie there. Like, I have always loved Crocodile. I mean, I've never hated Gen 5, unlike quite a few people who now regard it as one of the best games. I always liked it, and Crocodile for sure was part of that reason. Okay. Well, luckily, this is not too far. TM. I went. I did this all. For Sandstorm. Could have a Gligar. Also another Pokemon that I really like. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. We don't have to worry because... It's a good thing I didn't get a Sigalith. Which... If we're going back into Gen 5 talks. More closer to Gen 6. Using Sigalith... Was annoying, but fun... The amount of people that hate that Calm Mind stored power strategy. And look, we are a genius. Because we knew Executor was coming. And we didn't want to leave our Gyarados against it. 
We're gonna knock it out right here. See, genius plays. I'm pretty sure you're a fighting type. You're a fighting type. Had someone say that this, that that chance he's a beast. I have yet to see it. Don't think I'll ever see it in action because I don't want to catch it. I I do have that Safari Zone encounter I can go get, but I don't know. I don't know. Onyx, why why would you swap? Why would you swap? To the Chansey that's weak to my thing versus the Onyx that would have resisted my hit. Like, come on, use your brain. It's a crit. Crit did not matter, probably, because that's four times effectiveness, and Onyx is just trash. Let that be known. And last but not least, Motham. You're going to hit me with a flying move, aren't you? We'll go Charlie. We haven't used Charlie enough in our Let's Play recently. I say it like every time. And yeah, flying. Air Slash does quite a bit of damage. But we do plenty of damage back. Let's go. Easy. Easy mode. Okay, let me get my super potions. Bop. Bop. Ah, Cookie Smash, you should be fine. Okay, let's keep going. Okay, we already went down there. Don't have to go down there. Like, I don't want... <laughs> this desert's just bad. I should have bought more super repels. Really should have bought more super repels. But it's okay. Come on, come on, come on. Run. Let's see. Is this... Sand Trap Cave. What is Sand Trap Cave? He will be my opponent for this event? Explore Nathan. I don't understand what's happening here. Mandibuzz. Okay. Okay. Um, I'm kind of... I'm honestly a little confused. Man, I'm going to hit you with... You're going to flinch me, aren't you? Okay, good. Like, you're done. I have quick attack. Does not matter. Easy. Easy. Next up... Lunatone. A little more threatening. Quite a bit threatening for our team. Lunatone is the death of us. And we got the rock weaknesses. We have the psychic weaknesses. Should have known the rock was coming, but I've... I, I just figured that with having the Intimidate, we would be fine. And we were. Lunatone, goodbye. What's next? Soul Rock? I could see it. We are a physical attacker, though, so let's... Keep that in mind and keep Crush Claw. What's next? Soul Rock. Okay. Okay. We can handle Soul Rock too. I know this Stone Edge will hurt a little more, but it does not matter because Soul Rock is done for. And last but not least, we're rocking against a Spinda. Okay. Great. Not yet. Not yet. We're not doing the Dragon Dance yet, but if it comes down to it, possibly. Okay, let's just heal back up with our Hyper Potions. Oh, we're good. We'll keep our team the way it is. I don't know what this place is. This is an encounter, though. And that's a Dupes Clause. And I don't want my encounter to be a Doug Trio, so I'm gonna avoid that Doug Trio and get my encounter. <sighs> We're not gonna get exploded on this time. 
Oh, if I would have caught that rock and roll in the last cave, this could have been something great. Like a... Sanshu. No, I, I will 100% take our boy what we got versus Sanshu. And... I'll take I'll take Rog and Rolla. Rog and Rolla is not bad. Gigalith is not a bad Pokemon. It's just not a Pokemon I see adding to my team compared. Okay, I I, I guess Rog and Rolla is best option. Where am I going? I <laughs> we could have had a Sand Dial. See what I'm talking about? And it's a hidden ability Sand Dial, which could be Moxie. I don't mind for Dwebble slash Crustle, but... Bro, where do I go? What is this? Okay, I can't go this way. This... this... Could have had Skaroopy. Drapion was such an amazing Pokemon for us in one of our last Nuzlocks. Would have taken it. I honestly... I... I don't know if this cave even leads to anything. I'm upset. I mean, okay. We can't go that way. I guess I can't go this way yet. Stop showing me good Pokemon. Game. I'm out. I, I'm i done being insulted by showing me amazing Pokemon I could have had that I unfortunately did not get the chance to. Maractus, you're not one of those, so goodbye. Okay. Hyper Potion. You know what? I'll take those. Those are worth it to me. Darumaka. Talking about great Gen 5 Pokemon? A lot of the desert Pokemon, it seems. Except for you, Maractus. I don't... I don't know. Maractus... I feel like Maractus is one of those Pokemon that are a single stage that needs an evolution. Like, it could be good, but it just... It, it feels very second stagey. They didn't give it enough power as a... Ah... Ah, that makes sense. So, what those sand... I'm assuming those quicksand patterns take you down to the sand traps cave. And that's how I get access to the other things there. That makes sense. I hope I don't have to go in there. <laughs> because I don't want to pick the wrong one. Okay. Goodbye, Maractus. I don't think I want mirror move. No. Yeah, stop learning mirror move. Next up, carving. I'll go goose. Like he doesn't have the attack stat. And he's missing. I'm I'm just going to knock you out fast as possible. No worries. Carbink, goodbye. Like, I don't think his moves were going to do that much damage because it's a Carbink. That's, that's Carbink, another Pokemon that's very... needs another stage. Like, if Carbink evolved into Diancie, sure. But Diancie's a mythical, and it wouldn't be that way. Ooh, you're faster, but Toxic Spikes is the last Pokemon. Interesting way to go about it. Goodbye, Drapion. You're done. Explore Drake. I'm gonna stay away from that sand pit. <laughs> I just I hope. I hope the sand pit's not the way we need to go. And I'm I'm kind of getting tired 
Like, I feel like exploring all of the caves, not the caves, the towns are fine. Can I please speak to you? Backpack man? Okay, come on. Okay, I'm going to grab that item because I see it, but I'm not going to bother completely exploring these routes anymore, I guess. Ooh. Rock is going to hurt. Why did I swap? I'm a fool. I'm a fool. You're going to go rock again. Why didn't I go Koki Smash? Koki Smash is a good Pokemon to fight Ivysaur with. The the small brain plays right here. See? Small brain plays when I could have been making big brain plays. Ivysaur, you're done. What's next? War Turtle. You know, because you're flying type, I should have swapped out. But Koki Smash is just a beach, beach, beast, that it doesn't matter. Next up, Poison, Fire Punch. I'm going to quickly deal with it right here. Done for. And last but not least, you have, drumroll please. Yo, Sphinxion. Kind of cool. I'm sorry, Koki Smash. I don't want you to learn superpower. I'm going to stay with the safe and nice drain punch. And I'm going to collect this item because I see it. Sandile, I wish I could catch you. I have quite a few Pokemon in my PC. I, like... <laughs> okay, A what now? A what now? Okay, just a high selling item. A firestone. Like, I don't feel like I need. Oh, shoot, I might have made a bad decision here. I made a bad decision here. Come on. No encounters, no encounters. We got so far. I mean, you know, Firestone could be useful. Sandile could also be useful, but I can't get one of those. I think we're good now. Ah. Why well, can't I, I could be out of this area? I made the bad decision to run back deep into the depths of the desert. And I just want to escape. Come on, just just a little bit. Just a little bit. Ooh, hi, Hippopotas. Like everyone, I used to think that this one was shiny. I don't think that anymore. Ah, we're so close. Just one step. One step, one step, one step, one step. We're free. Dunestone Oasis. I feel like there's wild encounters right here. Relic Silver. But maybe not. A shaka berry. Okay, well, I think I'm going to wrap up this episode right here before the Dunestone Oasis area. We can't get a water encounter, so there's that. Whatever that might be, we could catch. But I'm going to see you guys tomorrow. But until then, everyone... Peace.